Tonight's story is a real thrill ride. Welcome to Urban Legends. Early one morning, a young man began a long journey from Illinois State to Wisconsin. It was cold and snowing, but the man was used to driving in these conditions, so he set off on the open road. The weather was relentless, but the young man carried on. He had crossed into Wisconsin now and making good time, so he stopped for a bite to eat and a drink, while resting his eyes from the road. Inside the diner, all the customers were talking about was the snow and the fact that there was a blizzard coming. The waitress turned on the television and the newscasters reiterated what everybody else was saying. The man paid the bill and headed out again, refreshed and eager to get on with his journey. After only a few hours, the man spotted something up ahead, in the road. As he got closer he saw that it was a young lady, a hitchhiker. He usually didn't pick up hitchhikers, but due to the severe weather, he decided to make an exception. The lady sat in the back of the car and was very quiet, speaking only when spoken to. She asked to go to 14 Beaumont Road, but did not say why. When asked how far away the house was, she replied that it was just a few miles down the road in the town of Fairview. Painstakingly, the man found his way to Fairview, but thanks to it being a small town, he was able to find Beaumont Road quickly. Pulling up outside number 14, he said to the lady that they had arrived, but she didn't reply. He turned around to see if she had fallen asleep, but to his surprise, there was nobody there. She had simply vanished. The man just sat in the car, completely perplexed, but he also wanted an explanation so exited the vehicle and walked up to 14 Beaumont Road and knocked on the door. A short time later, an old lady opened up and the man explained what had happened. The lady looked sad, and invited the man in. She sat him down and made him a warm drink, then took a photograph off the mantelpiece. She showed it to the man and asked if that was the young lady he had given a ride to. He said that it was. She explained that over 30 years ago, her daughter had been killed on the same stretch of road where the man had picked her up. It was a snowy night and she'd had car troubles. While trying to figure out the problem by looking at the engine, a jeep had skidded off course and hit her. She died instantly. The tragedy was that she was so young, and only wanted to get home. Now every so often on a cold wintry night, a stranger will knock on the door and say that he had picked her up, only to have her disappear when she arrives at 14 Beaumont Road, her home. The Vanishing Hitchhiker, also known as the Ghostly Hitchhiker and the Disappearing Hitchhiker, is a famous urban legend with many variants found in England, Korea, Russia, South Africa and France. In some versions, the hitchhiker gets out at their destination, only to leave a garment behind. But when returned to the family, the driver is told that the owner of the garment has been dead for some time. In another variant, it is actually the driver who is an apparition of somebody who is deceased. In most cases of the vanishing hitchhiker though, a young lady is picked up on a lonely stretch of road by a male driver, and she disappears before the end of the journey, usually discovered later that she has been dead for many years, having died in a car accident. So, if you're out late one night and somebody waves you down for a lift, you might want to think twice before stopping. Not only is it dangerous, but the person you're picking up may not be a person at all. That concludes tonight's story. I'll see you next time for more urban legends.